It is time now for Ask the Expert. The month of June is Men's Health Month. Yeah, and here to talk about important things that men should remember when it comes to their health is Dr. Neil Johnson, a physician with Aurora Healthcare. Welcome, Dr. Johnson. I know that kind of one of the reasons we even need to have a Men's Health Month is because I guess, Ben, and we can be a little bit reluctant to go in and go to the doctor when we should go. Hey, thanks for having me. You know, in my world, every day is Men's Health Month, <laughs> right. uh, as well as Women's Health Month, but it's nice to have these opportunities to emphasize you know, some of the important things that we should all be remembering. And it's true, there's actually been some research uh, shown that men are more reluctant to go to the doc. And uh, different from women, uh, it's been proven that uh, men have a tendency to, to downplay uh, their health mm -hmm. um, for uh, perhaps a fear of uh, seeming vulnerable. Uh, uh, against their, you know, their friends and, and family. They don't want to be seen as weak. And uh, what we try to tell folks is, you know, gosh, going to the doc is not a, a weakness, it's a, it's a strength. Mm -hmm. One of the other uh, parts is certainly um, lack of knowledge. You know, you fear the unknown. Mm -hmm. uh, when you take your car in, it's making it a funny sound and the mechanic comes out and says, hey, we got to talk. You know, that's a, that's a horrible feeling. Well, it's the same thing in the, in the medical field. Mm -hmm. uh, sometimes they fear the results, but uh, also getting a clean bill of health can be very reassuring. So what should all men be doing or what do you recommend? Well, the, you know, the list of, of, of screening things that most men should have is quite long. Uh, but so what I recommend is uh, uh, you come in for an annual physical exam. If they can remember anything, just to have come in for a physical. And if everything's going well, you know, we can leave you alone for a year. <laughs> but uh, the, you know, the experts in preventive health you know, want us to uh, be checking s uh, certain things uh, down the road. Uh, blood pressure check every year, cholesterol check every once in a while. For men in particular, you want to have a conversation about PSA, you know, the prostate uh, mm -hmm. test. It's not for everybody, but we want to talk to your doc about it. One of the new things that's out uh, is the colon cancer screening. Uh, previously was 50 is when that starts. Experts are now recommending that starts at 45 because of added risk. Uh, so one of the things we were showing earlier is some different foods and I guess that's kind of the way men can kind of start uh, helping themselves before they get to the doctor. I tell you the basics are, you know, are timeless, you know, keep your control of your body weight, make sure your blood pressure is, is uh, under excellent control. If you have high cholesterol, deal with it, okay, there's no symptoms now, you, you pay the price later if you ignore it now. So when you go and see your uh, provider, um, these are the things they're going to talk to you about and come up with your plan for the year. So you know, we take this opportunity this month to kind of remind guys to come on in and you know, let us be your team physician. All right, Dr. Johnson, thanks for being with us. We appreciate it. And